When last we left our intrepid explorers, they were about to enter Eurydica. Probably going to get a cutscene. Because game. Hey, there's a cuckoo. So this is where mom grew up. Where's your house? Toward the back of town, I think. It's right next to a well. Before we continue, let me refill my supplies. Please and thank you. Oh God, so much more. I'm really happy that I grinded out some some fossils. It was needed. Right. Um, back it. This brings back memories. Let's keep going, Mom. I unloaded Rosemary. She's magically gone from the bed. The emergency bed is empty. I bet she's going to be in my arms. Okay. I hope you like being carried by a handsome young man with a sombrero and a fro. Also only wearing swimming trunks. Thank you for your help, Vanilla. No problem. Uh, excuse me. Oh. Just because no one lives here doesn't mean you can just barge in. Rosemary? Is that you? Maybe. Daniel? You are the innkeeper's son. It's been so long. Is this your daughter? Damn. Either Rosemary aged incredibly gracefully, or that guy was older than she was by a long shot. I'm Connie. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> You're just as cute as your mom was back in the day. Shut up, old man. And how perv. about you, young man? I'm Vanilla, Connie's boyfriend. Ooh. Huh? But we did. <laughs> anyway, I'm the innkeeper now, so uh, let me know if you need a place to stay. What do you have planned, Connie? Well, I still need to unpack, and I'd like to clean up a little. Hey, can we stay here until tomorrow? Sure. Sure, we'll stay the night. I'll be at the inn. Even though I'm your boyfriend. Thank you. Connie, Hopefully. why don't you go to the hot springs? I think you'd enjoy that. That's a good idea. Maybe after I'm done cleaning. I want to join you. 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 Just want to get naked. We should get back to Happy Garland tomorrow. They might have already found our next gig. Uh huh. Should be a lot of fun. I give her a gift. I don't have anything to give her. Thank you. Please continue being Connie's friend. Oh. I'll be more than that. Can't wait to call you mom. Maybe, possibly, for sure. Alright, can I do the hot springs? Oh boy, there's hot springs here. I can't believe there's hot springs here. Oh my god, it's so good. Water in this here hot spring would be good for sore backs, muscle aches, and all sorts of maladies. It even helps maintain healthy skin, bones, and hair. Ah, it's so refreshing. I can't believe it. It's amazing. Oh, yay. So I did tweak some of the video settings and I found that I could remove some of that motion blur, but it would really pixelate the image, and I'd prefer not to do that. This is the end, this is the end. Hey, old man, I've stayed here before. Just, just so you know. Well, well, welcome to our remote little village. We've got an, all we've got is an inn and a general store. If you'd like to stay for a while, just to help yourself to one of the beds in the back room. You only have one room? One room. There's a bed here. Would you like to rest? Sleep until morning. The sound of trapmobiles disturbs the sleeping citizens of Eurydica. Alarmed, I jump out of bed. Womp, womp, womp. Vanilla, it's Connie. They kidnapped her in some trapmobile. Fuckers. Coming for him. They had a, a kid, too. There aren't any kids in this town, 
So I don't know. Malo. They took Malo. They took Malo. Time to move out. Let's get back to the hideout. He's upside down. Save data. Because it is totally better to be safe than sorry. Board it. Coming for you, motherfuckers. Take my girl. Take my sort of friend. Let's see how this goes. Enter the cuckoo forest. Yes, indeed. Thick carnivorous forest. In recent years, reckless logging made possible by new industrial automobiles has led to a drastic reduction in trees. So, is that a mantis? I think that was the bloody mantis. If it was, right back to the fucking desert I go. I guess it wasn't the last time I'd have to be at the desert. The trick though is figuring out where the fuck I need to go. Maybe Dandelion has an idea. Well, let me go talk to him. Hey. Oh. What's up, Fennel? Hey, Vanilla! What's up? I just saw some trotmobiles carrying Connie off. What's going on? You didn't... You... You didn't try and stop them. She was kidnapped. Where were you? I told you to take care of her. Fuck off, dude. It was the middle of the night. Was... Hagen, I'm sleeping. Follow me. We're getting Connie back. Right on. You guys, got some get up and go. Continue to Owl Woods? Yes, please. Hoot hoot, baby. Hoot hoot. Giant trees of the forest encircle the calm waters of Lake Owl. Um. Uh, okay. Oh, yeah, it is hoot hoot, baby. Sweet. Oh, hey, look at that. The ship I'm gonna have to destroy. The fuck? Okay. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just get in here real quick. Let me get off of that. Making me is a. Alright, this is where I'm supposed to go. Looks like it because there's a blue thing. Imagine that's. Yep. I am fucked! Got no health. Yo, Dudley, what are you doing here? Yeah, Duds, what's up? Papano? Why are you here? Why are you getting freaked out? Two trotmobiles just made off with our friend. Did you happen to see anything? You mean Connie, right? Yeah, I saw her. They ran into that weird building. God, please don't make me fight him again. Did you see anyone else? Huh? Well, now that you mention it, there was another kid with him. But who cares? Look how freaky that building is. I think it's a storehouse or something. I saw him carrying some crates inside. 
That's a zeppelin. I heard the bloody mantis is collecting money in all kinds of illegal ways. That must be where they keep it. Tell you what, you guys help me steal it, and we'll split the loot 50-50. Jeez, don't you think of anything besides... Wait, that's a great idea. Hey, you in? Sounds like a plan. Sure. Gets me okay. on there. Okay, here's how it's gonna go down. Dudley and I will lure the guards out, while you gain control of the bridge. Why him? Because he's the this best. This is the bloody mantis we're dealing with. Fooling the guards is gonna take skill. Ha <laughs> ha, you're right. I guess he couldn't handle that. Once you get to the bridge, just sneak inside. Find Connie and get her out of there. Of course. That's why I agreed. Thanks, Fennel. Alright, now, if only I wasn't gonna die. Oh, I'm not going to because... Wait a minute. Because there just happens to be conveniently a guy that will let me refuel and uh, resupply. Uh, maybe? No? No? Well, shit stains. Alright, we'll do this. Well, quick save, because that seems like a smart thing to do. Park it. Do your thing, boys. Do your thing. Yeah, I'm just parked here. Nothing. Nothing going on. Yep. Nothing to see here. Just half naked man with a sombrero running. Running to get onto the Zeppelin. Because what you do when you're trying to save your lady friend. Don't get caught in a light. Didn't get caught in a light. This is good. Hey, look. Enter mysterious facility. Uh. Yeah. Large, strange building. I entered a huge building in the lake. It was an enormous structure with rounded features. I mean, it looks like a blimp. Is this not a blimp? Am I not in a zeppelin? Is this thing not going to fly? Hey. TNT and something covered up. Why would you have a giant container of what is apparently TNT? Why would you have explosive containers on your ship? Well, I mean... I suppose if you were trying to blow something up, that would make sense. Hey, you there! Ah, shit. How'd you get in here? Uh, I walked in? I mean, it's pretty simple, dude. Your guards are, are kind of shitty. Did I find Thank my goodness. lady, though? Did they capture you, too? Did. Connie? Is that you? Huh? Who's there? It's me, Mallow. What's up, Mallow? Mallow? I'm sorry, Connie. I was so messed up back then. How, how can you talk about this right now? I was just jealous of Dandelion. It was so stupid. I'm not better than anyone else. You damn right you're Stop not. Stop it! I don't want to talk about this. I can't apologize enough for what happened to Chicory. I know you can never forgive me, but I am sorry. I'm so sorry. So what? Now you're different and I'm supposed to forgive you? No, I just wanted you to know it's my fault. It's always been my fault. Living all by myself, I realized how important all of you were. I'm not the same Mallow. Well, good for you. At least one of us was able to let go of the past. I want to forget it all. If only I hadn't invited Chicory. If only I hadn't been late. It isn't fair. How come you get to apologize? Connie? I'm sure the others understand. Why are you wasting time? I thought we were ready to launch. Yes, sir. We did find an intruder, though, Commander. Hmm. I'm impressed he could sneak past our security and infiltrate the grand finale. What a name for a ship. Hello, Miss Coriander. Wipe those tears. It pains me to see you unhappy. Who the hell is this creep? These accommodations will have to do a while longer. 
But I assure you, once this is over, I'll give you a very comfortable bed. No, you don't, you bastard. Fine. So you're Mallow, are you? Hm. You have most devilish features indeed. Uh, sir? Mallow's in the other cell. What? Ha! Ah, so you're Mallow, are you? Hm. You're even more evil looking than that other kid. I'm not evil. The fun is just beginning, Mallow. We have a lot planned for you. And what the fuck did this kid do to piss these people off? If you're not Mallow, who the hell are you? I'm vanilla. I'm here to save Connie. Sir, this is the intruder I spoke of. Ah, yes. Well, we don't want to weigh ourselves down, do we? Toss him overboard! You smile, my smile face. Miss Coriander, but I must be on my way. Adieu. Who is that guy? Owl Woods. Not only did I fail to rescue Connie, but now the huge structure she's inside of it is slowly starting to rise. It's a uh, Zeppelin. Oh, I thought they were gonna, like throw me overboard, like legit throw me overboard. Well, that worked out. Good job, Vanilla. Are you okay? What happened to Connie? She's up there. She's safe, but... <sighs> Quick, untie me! Jeez, you're no help. F fennel What the hell is that? It's me. Nothing that size should be able to fly. The only person who might know about that is Dr. Nutmeg and... What? It's turning toward... Happy Garland! What the hell are they going to do? You should head for Dr. Nutmeg's place. He might know how to stop that thing. Dudley, you and I are heading into town. We have to warn everyone. Okay. The Nutmegs. Well, this is going to be a bunch of backtracking, so... Um... Yeah, until next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. I wish I had emotes I would wave. Bye.